it's the AS show, it's the last day and we're on the uh, Fredenstein booth and we're looking at the mix cube which is a summing amplifier unlike any summing amplifier I've ever seen so Hutch is going to tell me all about it. What's the story with this? This one here is a 32 by 2 digital controlled analog mixer. Uh, we can do it in steps of 8 so it can be 8 channel, 16 channel, 24 channel or 32. Uh, it's fully balanced all the way through, including the mix bus. Really amazing specs. Um, but the fun part is that we can change levels. It shows up on the display here. So it's MIDI controlled or USB controlled. Uh, we can change the level here. And it changes the level down there. Um, pan on every channel. There's four fader or VCA groups, so to speak. I was going to say, do you have any transformers in the signal path or is this all um, solid state all the way through? This box is like six and a half inches by six and a half inches. There's no room for transformers. You could have it just the one. <laughs> one little ones. Maybe. On the output, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, no transformers here. Uh, we're figuring people will probably hook it up to a compressor, that kind of thing for color. Yeah. Everybody's got their favorites. And maybe one day we'll make a little transformer box that's about the same size. Yeah. Uh, no, this one is pretty clean. So are there <laughs> any features in there, Hutch, that we wouldn't expect to see in a summing amplifier? Um, well, just the fact that you can automate it and save sessions. Um, but just being able to work a DOS session where you'd have an automated mix, this gives you a chance to have some of that automation happening in the DAW, some of it happening in here. Having inserts, uh, have your compressors, EQs, and the analog demand mm. in the path to this thing, it opens up a whole bunch of doors. Right. So theoretically, you could control the levels, levels in here from your door if you wanted, yes. and that means that all the changes are saved as part of your session. Yes. Which is the shortcoming with traditional summing amps. Right. Right. Okay, Hutch, this is uh, available in various different channel counts. Uh -huh. uh, what do the different formats cost? The 8 channel version is $12.99. Yeah. 16 channel version, uh, $19.99. Yeah. The 24 channel version is $26.99. Yeah. And the 32 channel fully loaded is uh, $33.99. That sounds pretty good. And they're shipping in the next couple of months, you say? Yeah. We expect uh, January. Okay. That's great. Thanks, Hutch. Good.